The term Frenching a rack comes from the technique of cleaning the bones off for presentation. To French the rack, we first want to start by scoring the rack right around where we want the exposed bone to start. So you'll notice I cut a little bit higher than the curvature of the rack itself, making some incisions along that line after I scored a line to be able to see and stay consistent. I go all the way through. Then I'm going to go through and scrape and score the membrane. What that allows me to do is to take the meat that is in between those bones and peel it away more evenly. So once you've got the membranes nice and open, you can then go through and clean each of the bones by pulling the rib out of the membrane and away from that meat. This method does require the most work and effort, but when you're trying to do a whole roast or individual chops, it ends up giving you a much prettier appearance. To cut the flap off, you can very easily just lift up the rack like you're stepping on a garden rake and then cut from behind and cut that flap meat off that has the membrane holding it all together. You can grind this down for um, any number of ground meats or cook it up as boneless rib meat.